good morning children today we will discuss distinguish property of solid liquid and gases first of all we discuss property shape in solid have the different shape liquid liquid have no different shape take the shape of containers in which they are kept but gases have no different shape take the shape of container in which they are kept in solid the molecule of solid is very tightly packed and cannot move about freely so solid have the different shape liquids have no different shape because their molecule are loosely packed and allow some movement of the molecule so the take a shape of container in which they are kept in gases uh, there have no different shape take the shape of container in which they are kept because the intermolecular space in gases in maximum and there is negligible intermolecular force of attraction so molecules have movement all directions so gases take the shape and volume of the container they occupy now second property is volume solid have a definite volume liquid have a definite volume but in a gas have no definite volume take the volume of container in which they are kept solid solid take up the same amount of space where it is kept liquid liquids take up the definite amount of space in a container hence have the definite volume now in gases gases take a shape and volume of container they occupy now next qual property is fluidity solid have the rigid shape and cannot flow flow because their molecule are closely packed in liquid liquid can flow because they are free to move around and slip slide and glide over one another hence liquid can flow and in gases flow easily in all direction because the molecules of gases move freely in all direction in closed container next properties free surface in solid the molecule of substance held together by strong force of attraction so they do not leave their fixed position to move away from one another so solid have the many free surfaces liquids have only one free surface at the top in gases the molecule in gases move very quickly in all directions as a result of this random motion gas do not have any free surface next property is space between molecules in solid the molecule are closely packed they have negligible space between molecules in liquid molecule are loosely packed then they have the some space in gases lots of space between the molecule now next property attraction between molecules in solid the molecule are closely packed they feel held together by strong force of attraction in liquid the molecule have the less force of attraction as compared to the solid and in liquid in a gas molecules apart from each other they held to the negligible force of attractions next property movement of molecules in solid only molecules are, are vibrate at their fixed position in liquid it move around within the liquid and in gases move freely in all directions now next property compressibility in solid generally not compressible because they have no intermolecular space between them in liquid slightly compressible because molecule have the some space and gases are highly compressible because they have the lot of space in molecules 
due to this activity we can compare the compressibility of solid liquid and gases in figure given the three series a filled with the solid sand b filled with the liquid means water and c is empty means filled with the air now try to compress the content by pushing the piston in each series what we observe that the piston can be easily pushed into the series that is empty because it contain air the piston series that contain water move only slightly when the pressure is applied and the piston of the syringe containing solid means sand does not move at all from these observations it is clear that gases are highly compressible liquid are only slightly compressible and solid are incompressible so children in this way we can distinguish the property of solid liquid and gases again children how we we can compare matter solid liquid and gas in solid definite safe and volume rigid and incompressible in liquid no definitely safe different volume can flow slightly compressible and gases no different safe or volume flow easily highly compressible thank you children